Thus, this question by a runner from out there who said, uh, you know, Ryan, should I drink water during the race or should I have a sports drink? Or what should I be doing during, during the 10K? Well, uh, uh, good question. And here's my answer to all of you out there who are running. Uh, if you're a first time or second time runner, uh, my advice to you is do get some hydration. There will be watering stations along the way. Take two, three seconds to grab that cup of water. Have a sip. A sip could be 50 ml. Don't glug back 200 ml because that's going to be sloshing around in your gut. But as frequently as possible, try and take a sip. Throw some water on the back of the neck that controls the temperature center in your body. You're running in Bangalore. It's a brilliant weather city, so you're not going to faint as much as maybe a hotter city like Delhi or Calcutta or Bombay. But still, nevertheless, your muscles heat up, so get that fluid in. Regarding commercial sports drinks, um, if they're available, they are not harmful, they're just glucose and salts. They're better than water, they hydrate you. One caution is a lot of people when they take sports drinks or when they're running, the, the mouth gets dry because of the glucose and the salt. So in the next uh, a kilometer or so, you're going to feel that, uh, you know, oh, I, I need some water and the watering station is not there. So if you have enough of time, pick up a sports drink, pick up a water, plug that and wash it off with some water. That's something perfect you can do. Or if you have a spouse or a friend somewhere along the way who's standing uh, on the sidelines who can give you your personalized uh, uh, coconut water solution or water or uh, commercial sports drink, please have that done. Some of you run with your own water packs. You could do that. Have fun. That's what I say to you. For the elite runners, you're already coming to us so you know what you should be doing through the entire race.